Well, hello there. I'm Kim Berry, editor of Food and Drink Business Magazine. Welcome to our weekly news roundup. Might be a quick one this week. I think it may rain on us, even if we are on the glorious uh, northern beaches of Sydney. Uh, shout out to Lion today. They're the first Australian brewer to achieve carbon neutrality. They've dropped about 20, they've had a reduction of about 28% in their uh, carbon emissions, which is about 30,000 tonnes. In our April edition, we had some fantastic stories on Lion and a number of other uh, food manufacturers and beverage producers and the work that they were doing on their sustainability practices. So please head to the website. The digital version of the magazine is still up and have a read. Uh, for uh, another brewer, a South Australian uh, icon, Coopers, uh, they doubled their malt exports to about 35,000 tonnes last year, in the last year. Uh, to food producers and brewers in South Korea, Thailand and Singapore. Coles has announced that it's signed uh, lease arrangements with Charter Hall for two high-tech uh, consumer fulfilment centres, one in uh, the western outskirts of Sydney in Wetherill Park and one down in Melbourne in Triganina, and I apologise if that's not how you pronounce it, a uh, business park. So they've signed the leases with Charter Hall. The automation uh, um, agreement is with Ocado, which is one of the world's largest in terms of uh, automating these customer fulfillment centers. Now, as you can see, long sleeves, raining, it's quite cold. Uh, it could be a hazy shade of winter, but not for white wine makers if the uh, wine, Australian Wine Institute uh, um, sorry, the Australian Wine uh, Research Institute and the University of South Australia have anything to do with it. They've developed a new magnetic nanotechnology that can uh, remove the haze forming proteins out of white wine. I didn't even know that existed, but it's clearly very important work. And uh, with that, please head to the website for all of the news stories from this week. And uh, um, <laughs> at foodanddrinkbusiness.com.au sign up for our weekly newsletters and this hastily today <laughs> produced uh, video bulletin uh, I'm Kim Berry over and out